All right, everybody, looky what I've got in. So now I've got two of the Ant 28, and we are going to do the upgrade. We're going to do the modify that I did in a previous post showing where I raised up the swivel, put the 40 degree tips in there. We're going to put the uh, kickstand that will go right here. We're gonna get rid of this M22 fitting and we're gonna uh, hard mount the trigger gun so this thing don't loosen up all the time. All right, everybody, this is the conclusion of the upgrade for the uh, Hydrotech Ant 28 surface cleaner. Uh, before I did that unboxing of an Ant 24 and showed you what we did to that one, and this past weekend, I actually upgraded two of the Ant 28s. So here's the half inch plate. We always use aluminum to give the spacer in, you know, to raise the, the swivel up off the deck a half an inch. So to understand what we're doing, so before these tips are all the way right here where the bottom of the outer shroud's at. So you only got this much room in between here and here of the ground because this is rubbing the ground, your brush is. So when your tip is that close and you only have a 15 degree tip, a 15 degree tip is very, it's almost like a zero tip. It's just very any spray. So when you walk, you're going to start putting spirals into the concrete. So as you're cleaning, it's doing this right here. So what we do is we raise it up a half an inch. That way it's not hitting the deck. As you can see, it's nice and smooth and not hitting anything. So when we raise it up, that gives you, instead of about a, Instead of a half an inch off the ground, now you have an inch and a half off the ground. So from the tip to here, that brought it up an inch and a half. So as you can see right here in the tape measure, to the black back part of the black or the bottom part of the, the bristle, that's an inch and a half. Or right here, you see it's only a half an inch. And this tip was literally right down here. So now you're an inch and a half off the ground. I put 40 degree tips in there, so that's a wider fan. And now when it's spinning, we left the pusher tips. These are what you call pusher tips. It's like a zero tip, and it helps push this bar and spin it faster. So that way it's not going slow, and you're still putting lines in the ground. So with the pusher tip, it spins it faster. You got a 40 degree spray, and now you can walk at a normal pace. So that's what we do to soup these things up. The other thing that we do is right here is the kickstand. So the kickstand is where your handlebar will come down and hit that bolt and it won't fall to the ground. There's nothing more tiresome than having to hold the handlebars and the weight of the hose as you're cleaning. You do that for eight, 10, 12 hours, your shoulders are wore out. This way all you're doing is using your hands to push the surface cleaner instead of having to hold it. So with the kickstands, we put those on there. Right here is the M22 fitting. So the M22 fittings are known to loosen up and come loose. So like when you make your turn, all of a sudden they'll loosen up and your trigger gun turns out because you're pulling a lot of pressure hose. So like when you're making your turn, that trigger gun will loosen up. Now you gotta get it and try to tighten it back up. That's annoying. So I'd get rid of the M22 fitting and we thread the trigger gun directly to the wand and the hose that runs inside here. So now it's hard, it's not gonna swivel, it's not gonna come loose, it's a solid system. Stainless steel plug on the end, stainless steel pressure washer, and that concludes the upgrade for the Ant 28. So this one is ready for pickup. I got a customer coming this morning to pick this one up. But if you look on the table, see how the, brush, the bristles are right there on the ground? That keeps a lot of the splatter coming out of it and it concentrates the heat inside this housing to do the, the penetrating and the cleaning. So by raising that tip up to here, 40 degree tips, putting your spacer in there, putting your kickstand on, putting a solid mount trigger gun on there, your life is much easier. So your productivity just increased big time. Less time on the job, saves you money on fuel, labor, and you can get the job done and get in and out and get off to your next job. If anybody's got any questions, give me a shout out. You know my number, 
9063. Give me a call today. Everybody have a great week. Peace.